Well, today is reset day number one for the summer. Sunsets like a tangerine. Let's find a road we've never seen. Life is short, make it sweet. <laughs> we've been here um, in northern Nevada in Reno for two and a half weeks now, and it's time to go empty the tanks. So it's we call it our reset day because everything gets cleaned up, everything gets put away, and we go dump and do that, and then Tom will fill the tank with water, and we will be reset for the next two and a half weeks. Next two and a half, maybe three weeks. We'll see. We'll see. We kind of plan this to be in the middle of the Labor Day weekend so that the dump station would not be busy. Hopefully. <laughs> we'll see. And we're leaving at uh, 8.30 in the morning, so hopefully we will get there and nobody else will be at the dump station if so we just wait big deal today's reset day okay well we got just got back somebody's letting all the flies in oh. <laughs> huh? somebody so we just got back from resetting going to doing emptying the tanks and um i just thought of it i haven't opened cabinets or anything yet but i need to be really careful because I've emptied them a lot. So there's not a lot of stuff in them. There's not a lot of stuff in them to keep everything from moving around. So I have to make sure that everything nothing was so falls out. Everything packed before. To a degree. So this is my, I'm gonna try this one. What's in here? Um, coffee cups and wine glasses and eh, Looks to me bad. like it like it made it. Yep, not too bad. Alrighty then. Not bad at all. There we go. Good. Good. What good. about the food drawer? What about this one? Yep. Okay. There's... All your mixes. Spices. You... Spices. Yep. They're okay. All right. The pantry. Oh boy. Move the dog water. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Dog water has been moved. All right. Nothing fell out. Nothing fell out. That's still pretty jam packed. So, <laughs> once in a great while, something will come falling right. out. But okay, go. we're good. Yay! Um, we'll see about the rest of them later. Go ahead. Oh, go ahead. You're the one that always does this. I don't know how to do it on this side of the car. Today, I'm the driver. Oh, geez. We are finally going to get fixed today. <laughs> I don't think I said that right. No, I don't think so either. We're going to the doctor for our an anal ch annual oh checkup. Oh my gosh. Well, the annual checkups. Of course, for, for one of us, it is the other one. Too much information. <laughs> I mean, come on, we share with you guys, but that's a bit much. <laughs> so that's where we're headed today. Yeah. While we're in Reno, at home, quote unquote, Going to the doctor. We had our doctor in Bakersfield for many years. So since we haven't been able to go back to Bakersfield on a regular basis and go see that doctor, we found a doctor here in Reno to go to, and um, so that's why we're going. That's why we're, we're going to the doctor. This is our second year going to this doctor. Yeah. So everything's there. All we got to do is go for the annual uh, a annual checkups. Get our prescriptions refilled. Get the prescriptions refilled. You know, we need more drugs. That's exactly what I need. <laughs> yep, yep. You ready for your footsies to get trimmed? Yeah. Come, baby girl. Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> You're a good dog. What's mommy doing? You watching? Yeah, I know. It tickles, huh? You're such a good girl. You're such a good baby. Let me get underneath. I know you really hate this part. This part really tickles. Baby girl, 
Look at that, you almost have a dog foot. Almost. Probably a little bit a little bit more to do. Let's see. Woo! <laughs> so when we were at storage the other day there was this box of stuff that said garage on it and it came from my mom's garage when she sold the house just stuff that got thrown in there like uh some old bungee cords so we're going through and obviously this is trash some of them they might all be trash who knows and then twisted up in them is this vintage archaic extension cord that definitely is not safe to use oh my goodness but isn't that funny look at that sure this is something my dad used regularly <laughs> that's so funny oh here's one for you this is pretty vintage and archaic too you'd put a light bulb in here it was like so your outdoor light you could screw this part into the fixture and then you'd have a couple plugs and still have your light. I wonder if they still make those, but a safer version. Yeah, look at this. Ah, that looks like dirt that's in there. Oh my gosh, so funny. Oh, it's a rain poncho. Is it gonna rain? Oh, I can wear this or you can wear this and come outside and watch the rig when it's raining. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. My name's not Dave. That's why you're wearing a poncho. <laughs> <laughs> what else is in this grab bag of a box? What is that? Oh, look. It's a paint roller thingy ma bobber that's. A paint roller thingy ma bobber. Yeah, it's the handle to a paint roller. There's one on here. Is it new? No, it's. Oh, it's picked. used. Yeah, I don't. Oh, we might be able to get it off of here. Huh. It's got rust on it. Yeah. Man, I think this is garbage. Well, They're pretty cheap. We could buy one at the Dollar Tree. Yeah. What else is in here? Ooh, some sandpaper. Oh, look at that. That always comes in handy. Look. And, ooh! A gold, a gold mine. Look at that. <laughs> Gotta love that. That goes in my junk drawer in the basement. And your can of goodies. And my can of goodies. Nuts and bolts. That's a keeper. Oh, oh. Well, I don't want to use that to do the roof. It might take you a while. Yeah. I'll keep it though. Oh. Well, we're getting there. Still a little small. Yeah. Let me see. Oh, well, that's to open up a can of paint. Look at that. Yep. What else we got in here? Oh, got a paint tray. Yeah, paint tray. Oh, here's a file. I don't know why it's stuck in it. Oh, maybe Dad made a handle. He did. Look. Oh. He made a little handle for the file. Here you go. Makes it easier. Oh, wait look you, at that. Wait till you see this. Woo. Look at that. Ready? Okay. <laughs> You're turning the wrong thing. I know. Wow. That's not turning. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Does it have a year stamp on it by any chance? I wish. Wouldn't that be something? It's got wood, this is a wooden handles. Look at that. Wooden handles. Might want to hang on to that just to hang oh, on to that. Oh, we're hanging on to this. This was my daddy's. Oh Whoa. my. Look, Look what else I found. Look at this. Ooh. Look at that. Wow. Woohoo. Again. Made in the USA. Too bad it doesn't have a date stamp on it. I know. That's awesome. It's a Stanley. Yes. Oh, that's a nice one. We can use that one. Nice paintbrush. Yep, you want to keep this one. Woo, oh, looky there. Look at how cute cute little set of open-ended wrenches little more tiny goodies. ones more goodies what do we got here let's see it looks like some fixtures there's a hin a couple hinges let's see well you never know 
Okay, so we've got a couple hinges. The screws farmer in here. This. Oh, look at that's clever. Pipe fittings, but it's got them all bun zip, -tied, uh, zip -tied, together. tied together. So every all the pieces stay together. Yeah, that's it. I know you're gonna like this. Look what I found. Oh wow! Every now and then frequently actually we're looking for wire and I end up going to my craft stuff and using some of my good craft wire but here is hardware wire yay and look what else I found some painter's putty I wonder oh. what year that's from man this is heavy let's see how dried up it is Oh, yeah. What do you think? I don't know. It is putty. Yep. Oh. Did I say it's history? <laughs> I guess it's done. <laughs> so while we were at the Walmart in Lemon Valley, we met somebody who's a subscriber of hey. ours. Hey, Daryl. Literally, he reached out and went, Tom and Lori. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually in the bathroom and I heard Tom talking to somebody out there and I'm like, I come out and I'm like, who was that? And he says, a subscriber. I said, are you serious? <laughs> and then Daryl was walking out of the store and I waved, I said, come here. And we got a picture with we him. Had, we had to get a picture. We had to get a picture. So thank you so much, Daryl, for reaching out, saying hi. Yep. And um, you also sent us an email after we met, yes. which was great. And we may hit you up on uh, yeah, you your know. help that you <laughs> offered. So um, if anybody, if you ever see us out and about, please, please reach out and say, hey, yeah. you know, we would love that and get a picture with you. <laughs> so of course, Lori had to go shopping for hats. Yeah. <laughs> Whenever I see a cool hat, I just got to put it on. Guess what, everybody? Look what works. No, not Tom. The window. It goes okay, down. Okay, it goes down. Does it go back up? <gasps> it goes back up. Do it again. Down. <laughs> uh, that's how it's supposed to work. And you want to know what was wrong with it? We have a picture. We have a picture of the part that makes that go up and down. And that was what was wrong. Ever since we bought the truck in 2014, 2014, it was finicky. It would work and then it wouldn't work. We've replaced everything, different except parts. the glass. Yeah. And this piece. And this piece that's like half as big as me. <laughs> but now it works. Yay! Yay! Thank you to to Andy's Andy. Automotive. Yay! Yay! Thank you, Andy. Find the moment.